Hi everyone, uh, shout out to Willie Akio for having me on today. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe to his page. He's putting out some really good content for, for young players all over. <laughs>
and once you click the clubs you can go on down and choose a club i'll just choose my hometown calvary fc so you click calvary fc and once you go there you kind of just scroll down to the bottom and once you scroll down to the bottom you'll just see club information and you can click club information and it'll show their contact and once you see their contact you can kind of just plug in everything in there and you know send in all your information that you need to send and if they reach back to you that's great you can go further with the process you can send them highlights you can send them your cv resume and everything but yeah that is it's a good way to go on the website and try it on your own okay so way number four of getting into the cpl quite similar to number three but you know obviously if you have an agent or scout that's working with you then it is a lot easier um because these agents can get in contact very quick with coaches and they can they can send out your information and then they can you know decide if they want to have you or if they don't want to have you so having an agent is is good um not everybody has an agent not a lot of people can afford agents because sometimes agent costs money or sometimes they might just help you on their own will so yeah agency is good um you got to be careful um not to just you know go with any type of agent you got to make sure that your agent is trustworthy and you know that you you can you can trust them with with your basically your life here depending how important soccer is to you but yeah agents do help a lot um if you need any help or any questions with agents how to contact them you know how to talk to them about it you know you can message me personally you can dm me or you can message in the comments below and i'd be happy to you know guide you and give you some information about it but if you do have an agent it's great for you but if not if you don't have an agent then you know just keep working keep working on your craft and you know your time will come Okay, so now I'm gonna have one of my good friends. I consider him a brother to me. We played together last summer in the USL2. <clears throat> we had a great year together, scored lots of goals together. And um, yeah, his name is Corey Bent. So he's from England and uh, he moved uh, to Canada. He goes to school in Cape Breton at a university there. And they're a really good top university. He scored lots of goals and he made his way to professional through the ranks of the U Sports draft. So he went through the draft and he got first round draft pick and you know, that's super exciting for him. I definitely changed his life and I'm super happy for him. So he's just gonna talk to you guys basically about his journey and you know, how the CPL is for him. And I'm telling you, you know, this is something that could happen to anyone that has belief and works hard enough. So you guys listen up to him and you know, hopefully you guys gain some information on this. Hi everyone, uh, shout out to Willie Akiel for having me on today. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe to his page. He's putting out some really good content for for young players all over. So uh, make sure you like and subscribe. Um, signing a professional contract in Canada for me was, was one of the most um, relieving experiences I've had uh, today. You know, um, I've put a lot of work and a lot of effort into my craft um, alongside friends, family, coaches, and other people who have put a lot in uh, for me to be where I am today. So it's a, it's a testament to, to everyone's effort um, it's never just a one-man show. Uh, there's a lot of people that saw is involved. So that was one of my main feelings uh, once I'd signed the contract. The transition from Canada, I mean, from the UK to Canada, sorry, um, was, was difficult for me at first. Um, there was a lot to get used to, a lot of new cultures, new players, new systems. Um, and it was rough over the first couple of months, uh, especially being in university at the same time. Um, it wasn't very easy, but but I managed to find a way through it and, and I felt a lot better on the other side of things. So um, it might not always be easy in the start, but but what's for you, is, uh, what's coming for you is, is always better on the other side of the storm. The third question was, um, to anyone looking towards any professional league, um, for me, it was the Canadian Premier League, um, having Having faith in your abilities and doing what you do best um, is one of the most uh, lucrative pieces of advice if I've ever received. Um, you know, always to believe in your abilities and, and bide your time over the long run. Um, for me, it hasn't been a short journey. Um, I'm 22 years old, turning 23, and I've just signed my first professional contract, but I had the, the belief in my abilities uh, and timing that when the opportunity came around, I'd be able to take it and I'd be ready for it. So. Um, always play like someone's watching. Make sure uh, you pay attention to the little details because they're, they're what really matter in the end. And just keep believing in your own abilities. Anyways, guys, that's it for the video today. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned something from it today. 
And yeah, if you have any other questions, concerns, or anything you want me to answer, message me personally. You can DM me or you can just message in the comments below. I'll try to reach out to everyone. I'd like to reach out to everyone. So yeah, I um, hope you guys did like this video. Stay tuned for tomorrow's video. You guys will like it. And yeah, that's it for today. Awesome, guys. Make sure you stay determined, driven, and disciplined. And I'll see you later.